shadows and secrets lay in the gentle embrace of a fresh layer of snow. The yuletide bells, once cursed harbingers of anguish, now hung in silence, their tarnished surfaces reflecting the hopeful glint of a town reborn. But in the wake of that Christmas Eve, Edgar Montague remained haunted by the echoes of the spectral encounter, unable to escape the tendrils of the supernatural that clung to his very soul. As winter deepened its grip, Edgar found solace in the quiet corners of the town's ancient library. The dusty shelves held volumes that whispered tales of forgotten lore, and Edgar sought answers to the questions that lingered like lingering phantoms in the recesses of his mind. One frigid afternoon, as the sun dipped below the horizon, casting long shadows across the town square, Edgar stumbled upon an ancient manuscript, its pages brittle with age, ink fading like the memories it held. The title read, Redemption Beyond the Cursed Bells. In the dim light of a flickering candle, Edgar pored over the manuscript, uncovering the accounts of those who had faced the Yuletide curse and emerged on the other side. The inked narratives spoke of a ritual, a journey into the spectral realm where the past and present intertwined, and the curse's origins lay laid bare. Determined to sever the last ethereal tendrils that bound the town to its haunted history, Edgar embarked on a solitary pilgrimage to the very heart of the spectral realm. The skeletal trees stood sentinel as he approached the place where the cursed oath had been sworn centuries before. As Edgar uttered the incantations he had discovered in the ancient manuscript, the air shimmered with an otherworldly energy. The Yuletide bells, though silent, resonated with an unseen force, their spectral echoes guiding Edgar into the ethereal labyrinth of time. He found himself amidst the echoes of the past, the forlorn lovers, the treacherous betrayal, and the oath that had condemned the town to centuries of despair. The spectral mist, now familiar, enveloped him, and the ghostly figures of the cursed Yuletide tale unfolded before his eyes. Edgar Montague, a spectral voice echoed, not with reproach, but with a knowing acceptance. The apparition from that fateful Christmas Eve materialized, a guide through the haunted corridors of the town's history. The curse was woven in the tapestry of tragedy, the ghostly figure intoned. To break it, you must understand the sacrifices made and find redemption within the echoes of our past. As the spectral procession unfolded, Edgar bore witness to the heart-wrenching tales of the cursed lovers. Their love, twisted by betrayal and a blood-stained oath, had cast a shadow that spanned centuries. Yet, within the tragedy, there lay a glimmer of redemption choice that could free the town from the shackles of its haunted history. With newfound purpose, Edgar navigated the ethereal landscape, guided by the ghostly figures who had once been entwined in the tapestry of despair. The Yuletide bells tolled in harmony with his steps, resonating with the symphony of redemption that unfolded in the spectral realm. Pivotal moment as the past and present converged, Edgar faced the choice that would define the town's destiny. With a heavy heart, he unraveled the threads of the tragic oath, sacrificing his own sense of closure to free the spirits that had long been imprisoned by the Yuletide curse. The spectral mist dissipated, leaving Edgar standing alone in the quiet town square. The skeletal trees, stripped of their shadows, stood witness to the dawn of a new era. The Yuletide bells, once cursed harbingers of sorrow, now hung silent, their tarnished surfaces gleaming with a newfound serenity. As 
Edgar Montague emerged from the spectral realm. The town of shadows and secrets embraced a redemption that echoed through its cobblestone streets. The winter winds carried whispers of gratitude, and the skeletal trees seemed to bow in acknowledgement of the sacrifices made for the town's liberation. Edgar, his spirit forever marked by the spectral encounter, wandered into the winter winds, the echoes of redemption resonating within him. The small stood on the threshold of a future, unburdened by the haunting specters of Yuletide sorrow. As the sun cast its golden glow over the snow-covered landscape, the town awakened to a Christmas day, untouched by the shadows of the past. The Yuletide bells, their silent surfaces reflecting the dawn of a new era, stood as silent sentinels, guardians of a tale would be told for generations to come, a tale of redemption beyond the cursed bell.